Mindy dear, I am here. Miss Quill has arrived. Mindy, where are you? I'm ready. I'd like to make my video. Where is my company list? My pianist? Where is my band? I'm ready. Hello. Oh yeah, hi there. Miss, Miss Quill will just be right there with you. Wait a minute. Thank you. All right, dear. Well, who are you? Mindy, there's a bumpkin here. Please have her removed. Where is security? Mindy? Mindy? Hi. My name is Hyacinth. I guess you're... Miss Audrey Quill. Mindy! Get this creature out of here. Ellie Mae Clampett is in my studio. I'm just waiting for a friend. It's talking to me! Mindy! Oh, this is certainly Certainly not at my idea of a good time. <clears throat> Mindy! Ah, uh, look, lady, I just, uh... Wow. You know, I finally got to meet you. I got a bone to pick with you. Mindy! Yeah, I don't care. You can scream all you want, but I'm going to tell you something. You have royally screwed up my good friend Charles Gray. <laughs> Are you speaking to me, Macaw? I am speaking to you. Because you've hurt a friend of mine. You've driven him to drink. And I think you're a vile, despicable creature. I have the slightest idea who you are, what you want, why you're in my studio. I simply don't want you here. Please go away, little bumpkin. Mindy! I'm sorry, Miss Quill. I'll be there just as soon as I can. I'm very sorry. I'm coming. Mindy, get security. I'm sure you're not allowed here. Oh, well, yes, I am. I am an artist, just like you are. I am in the series Lovebirds, as are you. And you have completely destroyed my friend's life. Whose life have I possibly destroyed? His name is Charles Gray. He is a African Grey Parrot, one of the kindest, most intelligent, sensitive men I've ever known, and he's completely infatuated with you, and he has been driven to drink because of his unrequited feelings for you. <laughs> what a load of rubbish. I think you're quite delusional. I'm certainly not delusional, madam. And now that I've finally met you, I certainly see why you've been married so many times. 
why so many men find you so horrible. It's because you are horrible. And now I'm even more concerned about my friend Charles. So help me God. He will never have anything more to do with you. I'd have never met this fellow Charles. I certainly wouldn't want to meet a mere parrot. I don't like parrots. They're filthy little things. Fear not, Miss Belly May Clampette. I will have nothing to do with this Charles creature. Should I ever have the misfortune of crossing paths with him? You have no need to worry. Now please, get out of my studio!